Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Divinity Original Sin Enhanced Edition. Um, apparently taunt might not work. It doesn't work if the enemy has physical armor. These guys don't have physical armor. Ar armor. Apparently it might not also work if the enemy's aggression is high enough, that's what I've heard. Hmm. Windwalker. My body is broken. Oh, that's unfortunate for you then. You should have burned to death already. So that's effect should always apply to start of the turn. Come on now. Uses three. So I'll get up here using three. And then I'll use seven. And do that. That helps. Better than when it doesn't help, after all. Windwalker. Oh, uh, teleport again. He does have armor. I don't I don't even know. I do not know. Enemy will prefer attacking her. So it doesn't always attack her. It's just prefer, okay. Hey, it works it works pretty much half the time, so that's pretty good I'd say. But in the center. And boom. What? Yeah, yeah, do that. Eternal silence awaits. Okay, you're gonna smack me once, you're gonna smack me twice. Got it three times and po yeah, poison on your blade, but it failed. Boom. Think. There's that. And you died. Okay. Boom. I know what the issue is with the um taunt. It's not that bad. I can I can understand. It'd be a little too maybe a little too strong if it did it just that. everyone. Okay. 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 Um Buddy, you it's called walking. Get to it. Can't reach. Where is it? Inside the ground or something? Staff of Pergamon. A healing potion. Oh. That's the staff we need to grab. And then we're gonna want these resistance potions. And you'll want to heal. You can heal Bartor. Bartor. 
Okay. Interesting, interesting. Uh, we're not gonna go over there just yet. But, we're going to have you cast that. Now go and grab this chest as well. Staff of Pergamon. Cool. Decent. Eh. Okay. Oh. We need to open these as well. Fish. I hate fish. Ah. In game fish. I hate in game fish. This seems to be the location mentioned in Evelyn's diary. It looks like it, but where is the entrance? Who are you? Uh, excuse me, you're standing just exactly in my sun. Oh, you have a toxic nade. Black smithing. Like smithing belt. I think we already have one of those. John, what do you have? What do you have? Equipped. Yeah, you have a blacksmithing belt equipped. Um, gear. Gear I don't need. Okay. Fireball. Yeah. Mmm, no, I'm not- I'm gonna use staffs only. Give me a toxic nade. You obviously cannot afford this. Okay. Who are you? Me? Oh, I'm long retired now. Enjoying the sunshine is far preferable to gutting rabbits over city stones, after all. But they say a sorcerer's work is never done, but I seem to have finished mine quite in time to enjoy my golden years. So you're a sorcerer? Well, most certainly, though I haven't practiced in quite a few years. All the ferocity and fire of it just can't hold my interest the way I'm... Meadow afternoon on the beach can. You're giving me a strange sort of look, my friend. Is the heat getting to you? Yeah, it's very hot. I'm gonna catch fire. It should be our duty to end your wicked life, but you seem just so harmless. It should be our duty to end your wicked life. But you just seem so harmless. Agreed. Abstain from sorcery, and you'll have no problem with the likes of us. He, he probably is evil, though. Oh, sauce hunter, are you? Oh. <laughs> Aren't sauce hunters supposed to be a bit, uh, well, fierce and awe-inspiring? You look more like you'd like to settle down for a bit of sunbathing with yours truly. Help yourself, then. It's a big beach. Um... Do you know anything about source murder and Sicile? Source murder? Mm. Sicile? Oh, I don't concern myself with such matters anymore. Channeling source is more hassle than it's worth, and Sicile's a fish reeking backwater I've no interest in visiting. I'll take my leave. Go on then. Okay. <laughs> okay, wait, what? What was that noise?
I heard nice noises. Hmm. Maybe I, maybe I was hearing things. So, mysterious murder. The lair was guarded. We had to fight a sailor named Detmar, as well as his thugs. Map. So that was. Wait. Was that not it? Yeah, this was a definitely it. Revelant's secret lair. It's right there, it says. Really? How do we get over there? I'm wondering. Can I, um... Like... Teleport one of you? And then you guys can go over there. Hmm. Guess not. I don't know what then. Bread and cheese. Okay. I see that. That's a pearl. I need a pearl. Hey, Pinsir. Tell me about yourself. My friends, if I had more of them, would call me Pinsir. A pity there aren't more pals around, for mine is an upbeat, energetic, and optimistic character. If you ever feel like conversing over sunset or sunrise, you can find me here on this very beach, my home. Nothing old Pins Pins loves more than sharing stories, anecdotes, ideas, and opinions. What do you know about this corpse? Who was this man? His name I do not know, but I can tell you he was a very experienced pearl diver. But a few pearls a day wasn't enough. He wanted to be rich, better than the other divers in Sicil. How did it happen? Oh, I'm so glad you asked, for this is where the story grows extra juicy. He was talking, talking to those watcher statues on top of the cliff. We'll grant you a wish, they said. I want to swim like a fish, he said. Ta-da! You can now breathe underwater, they said. So down, 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 he dived. I guess the wish was a bust. <laughs> no, really. When did it happen? For sure. Yesterday, I was enjoying the mid-afternoon sun when I heard a strange gurgling. I looked toward shore, and there it was. The body of the pearl diver. What do you know about the watcher statues? Take my leave. But I know plenty more. Just ask. Come back. Oh well, it was great meeting you. <laughs> Don't be a stranger. You're my best friend. Oh, oh. Can you imagine risking life and limb for mere riches? Hmm. What a fool. Why court death Hello? for mere pearls? Can you hear me? Oh wait. Every tadpole aspires to be a frog. Ambition is what drives the world. Hello? No doubt. Any risk is worth the possibility of achieving one's dreams. I 
am on the trail, Source Hunter. No. You're back! My very best friend! Take a seat, stay a while. Leaving yeah. already? Come back! Oh, don't be a stranger. Don't be a stranger danger. Chip, chip. Okay. Well, I can tell you this. What is it he like definitely cannot breathe underwater. What is it like to feel? Oh. You can't feel? You should be able to feel. Should be able to feel just fine. Alright, did all that. The Watcher statue. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, dexterity. Oh, it's, it's your defense rating. Hmm. Speed. Let's up speed a bit. And now four. So I can now gain expert marksman level three. Mm, yeah. Yeah, I can. I don't care about crafting. I'm a lore master, though. There goes that. Personality. Whatever. Weapons. Sure. I should upgrade the bow, though. Yeah, I should do that. We'll do that next level. Uh, speed. Perception is quite high. But up, up your speed more, bud. Now you have three of these. Did you have two before? Hmm. Craftsmanship. Crafting. Blacksmithing? I haven't blacksmithed anything yet. Maybe I'll wait and get... Uh, uh, let's get that. Let's get that. Okay, this is an interesting place. Well, let's start. One look of you, mighty paladin of the waves, and your destiny is clear. You are meant to swim the seas. You can talk. I would love to breathe underwater. I would just walk into the ocean and keep walking out. What are you statues doing here? Cave, okay. We must prevent what lives within from escaping until due penance is done. But we long to move freely once more. But we are utterly trapped without our preferred elements to free us. To free us? Preferred elements? So if I shot you with some water, you'd be free? I heard you falsely told a pearl diver he could breathe underwater. Transform to gills. I swear it will work. 
Uh huh. So, talking statues. Born on the cliff who claimed to have magical powers. Apparently, a mysterious. She's not involved, okay. I guess the seal's mighty staff. But what are you doing here? Yes, let's find out. No, wait, wait. I'm ready. Let's see the future. Yeah. Um. Help. Help. What? What's going on? Oh, it's the. Oh crap. <laughs> it's the credits. That's my future. It worked. <laughs> wow. You I beat the game though. Technically. As I burn with the longing to flee this encasement. Hmm. Must stopping you from fleeing. Ah, curse! We four powerful beings all have been trapped here to seal the entrance of yonder cave. Oh, if only I had that scroll that magically unseals stuff. I used on the freaking warehouse door. Until all of us are freed by our favored element, the cave remains impenetrable. And what lies within remains trapped, same as we... He's probably dead by now. I did convince the man to burn all his possessions, but he gained neither fame nor renown. Oh, I like to keep my visitors on their toes, indeed. But in your case, most blessed spirit, never a fib passes these lips. Talk Cleanse yourself with fire, and you won't regret it. You can trust me. Attacking statue, that's rather unique. But talking is hardly the end of it. I also grant great fortune to those bold enough to address me. For you, I foresee great fame and renown. Oh, really? But first, you must prove your worthiness, your spiritual valor, by freeing yourself of all your worldly possessions. Burn them, burn them to ash, and watch your spirit soar. Ta-da, traveler! And don't forget, to find the true rewards of life, you must absolutely burn everything you own. Does this look like a face that would lie to you? It looks like a face that would kill me in my sleep. sleep. You look angry. I see you can talk, but can you actually grant the gift of flight? As sure as the sea is green. But hold still. I must first weave my magic spell. Bifferty. Bopperty. Ooh! There! The charm is complete. Go on, test your new powers. For your first flight, a sea ledge works as your best jumping off point. Okay, then I c it would be okay to have someone, a mage at the bottom to catch me, in case it doesn't work. I heard you told another man the same story, and he leapt to his death on a beach near here.
Okay. So where where is um the cave they're keeping sealed? Hmm. Keeping a cave sealed. Where's the cave? Anyways, let's go ahead and end the episode there. So as usual, thank you all for watching, and I do hope to see you all again next time.